This is my very first electronic wine bottle opener. And at the time of making this video, it cost just under £13, £12.99 to be exact. And yes, we did get it from Amazon. And first impressions, just looking around the box that is, it looks very nice. It looks very nice online. It's battery operated and no, it doesn't come with batteries. But I did read you have to install four double A's. So something to bear in mind. So with that, let's get her open and see what you get for your money, honey. If I can get her open. Oh, there you go. So we have the device itself and instructions. That's it. It's got, got quite a nice weight to it. Quick look around. And what's this? Oh, it just pulls off. So this is for cutting the foil off the bottle before you try and open it. So, you know, basically just do that. Just in case you don't know, put it on top, like I said, do a little twist, and hopefully the foil comes off. So here's the device itself. Oh, right, it's got a little window there. See that, so you can see it working. And a battery compartment, and yes, needs four double A's, which I will get right now. Right, I've done the batteries. <laughs> oh, something to bear in mind. Make sure that this goes underneath the batteries, all right? Because if you don't put this underneath, when you try and get the batteries out, because they've gone flat, you're going to have a job getting them out. Mine's already set up nicely. So first test is to see how noisy it is. Up and down, yeah? Don't know which way it's supposed to go to start with because I haven't used it yet. That's not too bad, is it? Yeah. Little sight glass, like I said. I'm assuming, pressing it down, I'm only guessing here, I'm assuming by pressing the down button, it should go into the cork, hopefully, anyway. And obviously, the other one brings it out again. We will find out. What I need to do now is get a bottle of wine with a cork on it. So, give me a second, I'll go and get one. Right, so we have a nice bottle of wine. Hopefully, it's a nice bottle of wine. I'm normally a white wine drinker, but this is a red, and it's the only one I had a cork on, so... This is the baby we are going to be testing it on. So first things first, we need to cut off the foil. And I know there's normally a pull-off, but this one doesn't have one. So we can actually use this, which is good. Normally you have a little foil thing that you can grab hold of and sort of, you know, do whatever. Oh, and that come off really easy. Look at that. So that was really easy. Hopefully that's not dried out too much. And all I have to do is put that on there like that apparently plonk it down a bit and press that button and there is a sight glass on there so i'm going to look at the sight glass well actually i'll try and show you as well and hopefully it will work oh i think that's worked yeah yes it worked Cork's a bit messed up, but it worked. So to extract it, all you have to do is press the top button. And it should just pop out. Cork is a bit knackered. The cork is actually a bit dry. So I'm not sure how long it's been sitting. But it works. I'm really pleased about that. Yeah. Go oh, smell that red. It's definitely red. So it definitely works, it's quite easy to use, it does slow down a little bit and I thought, oh, is that going to work? But, it has cleared it, it has done the job. And uh, yeah, very pleased, easy to use, easy to understand, I didn't even bother reading the instructions, I had a quick look just to make sure, but it works very well, very efficient and it's a good little gadget, it even shows you the cork going up there. And I don't think you're going to be able to see that, but... It, it works, it does the job, I'm happy with it. For the amount of money it costs, 
and don't forget I will stick a link in the video description in case you want to go and check it out for the amount of money it costs it's a good little catch it so with that if you like this video give me a thumbs up if you didn't you know what to do give me a thumbs down and uh, please subscribe thank you very much for watching oh and don't forget check it out